How's it going everyone? Cinematic Jesse here with another reaction video. Hope you're doing good. It's Friday night for me uh, at the time that I'm recording this at 11.24 p.m. So yeah, this is going to be my first time reacting to the music video Hope. I'm a big fan of NF and I'm a huge cinematographer buff as I am in real life. That's what I do for a living. I do photography, videography, and uh, yeah, so I love searching for videos like this. I love people sending them to me, and um, you know, I just, I, I've been really wanting to react to this one. I've had a lot of people send this, this one particularly to me, and then a couple of others, but I'll try to break it up as we go along, probably into uh, the middle of this month, I'll, you know, I'll do... Maybe, I don't know, maybe I'll do another NF like after the next one that I've chosen, which is not NF. I'm glad you guys are here. I appreciate the support that you've been giving me. I appreciate all the subscribers and the, the likes, the shares, and then, you know, you guys sharing your stories with me, like what what is your favorite like music videos out there <clears throat> and what you like about them. All right, let's, uh, let's get into it. There we go. Yeah, I'm on my way, I'm coming Don't, <clears throat> don't lose faith in me I know you've been waiting That piano I know you've been praying for my soul Oh, oh. That build up You've been dragging Piano. your feet, telling Love me it. I'm the reason we're stagnant. Thirty years you've been claiming your honest and promising progress. Well, where is he that? You know, can I say I'm a I'm a big fan of like these these drop in shots. As far as like panning in, uh, I appreciate the fact that they shot in 24 frames. That's very it's very cinematic. You're probably gonna hear that word like 50,000 times on this channel. I am a big fan of it. I love how they shoot. I love how they bring down the tones within the editing, the post-processing. It's just very, it's very real. It's very true to almost to where the location is. I mean, he's in the middle of nowhere. You got to love that drone work. I don't want you to feel like a failure. I know this hurts. That piano. But I gave you your chance to deliver. God, that looks beautiful. It's my turn. Don't get me wrong. Nature had a great one. But it's time to give the people something different. So without further ado, I like to introduce my my album my album my album my album my album hope what's my definition of success listening to what your heart says standing up for what you know is god that background <clears throat> and the foreground everything it just it's beautiful I really do love how they sh they shoot these videos. NF is a genius. He's a you know, he's a master at his craft and obviously this is the the direction that he chooses to go and I love it. I love every aspect of it. Um man, it's just it's beautiful. What's my definition of success? Creating something no one else can. What's, what's my definition of success? Creating something that no one else can. That's, man, NF, I love you, man. You and the crew, you guys just, you, you never cease to amaze me with this. 
And I found out that Tommy, I think Tommy Prophet worked on this as well. So shout out to them, Tommy Prophet and the crew. Amazing. Being brave enough to dream big, big. Grinding when you're told to just quit, quit. Giving more when you got nothing left. It's a person that'll take a chance on. Something that we're talking never happen. It's a person that can see the bright side through the dark times when there ain't one. It's when someone who ain't never had nothing in the fade to walk away from more profit because they'd rather do something that they really love and take the pay cut. It's a person that Notice that the character his well in the in the past um you see the darkness you see i mean nothing in, against like dark colors but you can see that he's rising up and he's moving forward with his life and you know he he has to let that other um he has to let that other person go which was his old self he has to you know bury him you know, tell them goodbye and move on. So that's what I get from that. But yeah, I'm, I'm digging the video so far. Now we never waver or change who they are just to try and gain some credibility so they can feel accepted by a stranger. It's a person that can take the fears in their life and turn them into motivation. It's believing in yourself when no one else does. It's amazing what a little bit of faith can oh, do. Oh, you're still with them. You don't yeah. even believe in you. Why would you think or expect anybody else that's around you to? I didn't did things that I regret. I didn't said things I can't take back. Was a lost soul at a crossroad who had no hope, but I changed that. I Years of my life holding on to things I never should have kept full of hatred. Years of my life carrying a lot of baggage that I should have walked away from. Years of my life yep. wishing I was Walk away from it. looking for some validation. Years of my life trying to fill a void pretending I was in. They get it. I feel like that part is a push that we all need in life to move forward. Even from our old selves. It's like, get your ass in there and move forward. Do it. <gasps> song. The mansions. Oh my God, I got chills right now. No way. Oh. That was beautiful. There he goes again. When you choose to not accept defeat and face your demons took me 30 years to realize that if you want to get the opportunity to be the greatest version of yourself sometimes you wow. gotta be someone and not the voice of reason having kids will make you really take a step back and look in the mirror at least for me that's what it did I his old self trapped in the cage and that's what happens in life if you do not go for what you want in life you will not go anywhere you will stay trapped and your, your legacy will not go on because you didn't do anything about it. And I'm one of those people that I've held myself back long enough and I choose not to be like that anymore. Wow. That's awesome. Damn. Wake up every day and pick my son up, hold him in my arms and let him know he's loved. Love standing by the window, questioning if that is ever going to show up. Up isn't something he's gonna have to worry about. Don't get it twisted, that was in the shop. Mama, I forgive you. I just don't want him to grow up thinking that he'll never be enough. 30 years of running, 30 years of searching, 30 years of hurting, 30 years of pain, 30 years of fearful, 30 years of anger, 30 years of empty, 30 years of shame, 30 years of broken, 30 years of anguish, 30 years of hopeless, 30 years of hate, 30 years of never, 30 years of maybe, 30 years of later, 30 years of faith, 30 years of hollow, 30 years of sorrow. 30 years of darkness, 30 years of hate, 30 years of baggage, 30 years of sadness, 30 years of stagnant, 30 years of change, 30 years of patience, 30 years of suffering, 30 years of torment, 30 years of hate, 30 years of bitter, 30 years of lonely, 30 years of pushing everyone away. You'll never revolt. I know I can change. We are not enough. We are not the same. You don't have the heart. You don't have the strength. You don't have the will. You don't have the faith. You'll never be loved. You'll never be safe. Might as well give up. Not running away. You don't have the guts. You're the one afraid. I'm the one in charge. I'm taking the hook. I'm taking the Reigns. I'm taking the reins. 
There you go. You heard it from the goat himself. When he mentions 30 years and 30 years of I'm going to rewind that back real quick. Let me turn this down while I'm talking. Look at that drone shot. That drone shot was just amazing. Let me turn this up just a little bit. To me, what I got from that was fighting yourself. He's battling himself. That's what it is. We are our own worst enemy. It's not even the people around us. It's us. It's yourself. And him, you know, him battling, he's battling with himself. He's been doing it for 30 years. That's why he, he says those quotes, 30 years, those lines, 30 years, 30 years of pain, 30 years of, of anguish, but it's, it's us. It's up to us to, to battle through this and push forward. Otherwise, we're going to get stuck. And it's not even other people that's, that's making us stuck. It's us. We get in front of ourselves. We are our own worst critics. I am my own worst critic at times. You know, if there's one thing I can learn from these videos, I know you guys are probably thinking, man, Jesse, you're, th you're getting too much far into it. No, I'm not. Because I feel like with him, you know, the lyrics that he that he puts on paper and then he brings it to life in video and music. It's. It just. It gets you all at it gets you all at once. Because, you know, that you're yourself, I mean, you can relate to him. You can relate to him. I mean, I have to say, the cinematography, everything in here is amazing. Yeah, that has to be a stabilizer right there, but I still love it. Using a gimbal on some of these shots is just, it's needed. Um, that's the cinematic look that they're going for. Now, I have seen a, another one of his videos. Um, I can't remember which one it was. But they shot it handheld, and it, you know, it's got that real emotion, that that uh, movement to it, is what I'm trying to say. Okay, so I wanted to go back to this part in particular, uh, at the beginning of the video. It's kind of giving me like castaway vibes. It's isolation. You know, we we have to part ways with our old selves, and we have to remove ourselves from certain situations in life and people. And I feel like this is what his persona has been since he's, you know, um, since the route that he's, he's gone is, is isolation. It's, if you look at his videos, it's, they're, they're isolated. They're away from everyone. And the person that he's battling the most is himself. When I saw this at the beginning of the video, I had to take notice of it. He's wearing the same clothing. You know, it's not, you don't have to be, he's dressed in rags. Well, I mean, I wouldn't call it rags. I'd say his personality. I'd say it's his, you know, it's what we all start off with anyways. Like we're, 
you know, we're brought into this world with a, a diaper and no clothes on our back and maybe a blanket and that's it. And I feel like this represents just isolation. Anyways, I just wanted to throw that in there. Uh, <laughs> sorry about that rant, but my key takeaways from this video is obviously the cinematography, his music is just, it goes up every time, like the level, the intensity, the, the overall message, take it how you want it. You know, it's a positive message in my eyes. I feel like watching this video, we're all isolated and I isolate myself from the world pretty much all the time, but that's only to get my mind right. That's only for me to, you know, to push myself into the next step. Well, I appreciate you guys being here again, showing me all the love and support uh, in my new journey and reaction videos. And I really want to say, you know, it doesn't go unnoticed. I've gained a couple more subscribers since I've started this and I couldn't be more thrilled. You know, I'm happy to share my experiences with you guys. I've got more on the way. Uh, I don't know if a lot of you knew this, but I also am a paranormal I guess you would say, I wouldn't say I'm a paranormal researcher. You tell me your name. My name is Jeff. <laughs> You'll see what I'm saying in my next video that I'm going to be dropping here pretty soon. It's going to be an eye opener for a lot of you. The paranormal world is not really what you think it is. But anyways, I'll save that for the next video. I appreciate you guys being here, watching with me, showing support. I will see you guys on the next video. Take care. See you soon.